Hey everyone, so um, it's been about a month since I came to Japan and I'm still loving it. I can't complain. Uh, I know during orientation the school stressed um, a lot about culture shock and how you're going to go through homesickness and you're going to get depressed, you're going to get mad, you're going to get frustrating, then you're just going to like mellow out and accept and all. I haven't gone through that. <laughs> The thing is because I did so much like looking into watching people, you know, do my own little research before I came that I prepared myself. So, um, like some things I guess would be considered frustrating for me, but I just accept it because I know, you know I don't expect it to be easy. But um anyway. Uh yeah, I haven't really posted anything, I haven't really gone anywhere really. Um school, you know, you're finally getting into school, so workload started coming on. It's not, it hasn't been too much, and then I was kind of sick a little bit, but I got over that. But, um, yeah, so I haven't really posted anything, but stay tuned, <laughs> because uh, next Friday we're going to Hachijojima, which is an island of Japan, and we're taking a boat trip, and it's going to be it's an overnight boat trip to the island. And we're going to stay there for three days because it's, it's a three day weekend and you know I'm going to record, take pictures, try to get as much footage as I can and I finally got my monopod so that's what I'm using right now so I got a hand free without it being awkward like that trying to do that so that will help especially with me being short I can see above things or like try to record above people heads <laughs> instead of being at eye level. <laughs> Uh, but okay anyway oh oh so I just got in not too long ago with some friends and we did Jomo whatever we went to Mita I forget the actual it's a, like athletic center and we did archery and I was so excited and I was so happy I didn't re record or take any pictures because I thought at first that we were only going to observe because that's what the little pamphlet said said first time observed then you can sign up for classes but as soon as we got there the man he uh, let us practice to see if we were good enough because me and another friend we've done it before and he he really liked me <laughs> he really, he was he kept commenting on my uh, stance for shooting and how good it was and how you know how nice and beautiful my friend is translating basically but so that was awesome if anybody knows i love doing archery ever since i did a, a previous college so that was really fun if you're interested it's at uh the meter station yeah, it's not it's not far from the station you just gotta like cross the jr area and then get to the subway well, from the subway jr and then you can get to the athletic center but um it was it's only two dollars per session so i'll probably start doing that every friday i think it's two dollars well spent especially i think it's about like three to four hours maybe so you can it is you know it starts at six so i'll probably go like right after class because my class ends at six on fridays but it was so much fun uh, i can't complain i loved it so much hopefully i will be able to like take a picture record it me and my friends or something so y'all can see it was it was it was really nice and everybody was so sweet even people we didn't know was just sitting in bye bye yeah come back and night and all that and they, they were really nice and we had the sensei is named Miyagi yeah I like karate kid it was Miyagi so <laughs> uh, we my friend told him about like asked him if he knew about the Karate Kid movie and once he like finally realized that's what we were talking about he started laughing and I even believe he said that he has a sister who actually teaches karate so she was you know she's uh, Mrs. Miyagi so you know Miyagi sensei and it was just really funny but he was really really nice it was really sweet but everybody there was was really nice so if you're interested definitely go there like I said it's uh at the meter station which is one stop before uh, the stop you get off for school Shirokane Takanawa so um, that's really it so 
I'll probably put, I do have a video when I was an Akiha brother that I never posted, so I'll probably put that together and post it, but, you know, you know it's Japan. <laughs> Not really more I can say. So I hope you guys keep watching and enjoying, and I'll see you later.